Okay, so the first one we're going to be playing is called Dark Taxi. I'm sure you've probably heard of this game before, but I like to start off simple. So let's give it a go. Made by Grit Gabriel. Ugh. Okay, very loud, very loud. Let's go. One, two, three. Right, so this one's on the more the creepy vibe. It's a um, bit of a spooks fest, so I'm ready. Okay, and I'll just wait for the taxi. Right, so we can walk on benches here. That's a pretty cool sign of a game already. We're going straight into it. Oh my god, there's a knife in the bin. Well, if a... <laughs> that tin can is super tiny. Look, that one right there. That is the smallest tin can I've ever seen in my life. No wonder you want to murder someone. Oh, taxi! I would never drive down a street that dark. Headlights don't even work. So yeah, it's a game about taxi. You're just waiting for a taxi. There's a missing child. Sani Tornzia, eight years old, bless him. Ooh! Ooh, hello. Hello, creature. Hello, stranger. What are you doing here at this time of night? I'll take a taxi. You're going to North, aren't you? Yes. Strange things happen the way there. Oh, dear! What was this? The, the English is very broken. Is he foretelling our future, you think? What a nice man. What a nice, gentle man. Okay, very creepy stuff. Um, liking it so far, though. I love the PS1 vibes. Still waiting for a dang taxi, though. Do you know what I mean? This is great gameplay. Oh, taxi! Yes! Alright, calm down. Taxi finally, finally the taxi arrived. Yay! Let's go. Let's do it. Twenty minutes later. Oh mate, I'm having time of my life. We finally got in the taxi. What this game is all about. Oh no, she. The sheep stided, or the whatever the heck they are. Okay, well that ain't good. Are you okay, taxi man? I am the conqueror of worlds! Conqueror of worlds! Right, so now we're just in a cabin in the woods. Oh, it's our friend! Who we fed. And that's that. That was that video game. That was very quick. So I'm going to give that 7 radios out of 10, to be honest. Because, well, I'd say maybe 6 bathroom supplies <laughs> out of 10. Um, because that was not bad. The second one we're going to be playing is called Warehouse Wrecker. Um, I think you literally just break a warehouse, to be honest. I mean, it's pretty as simple as that. Hell yeah, this is pretty badass. Except that we can fly. That's even more badass, really, if you ask me. So we're just breaking a warehouse. So we've got, um, left-click cannonballs, which I think we've just ran out of. We've got right-click bombs. Oh my gosh, that was pretty crazy. And we got a middle kit click nuke. So we might as well just go as far as we possibly can out. Well, that's completely ruined everyone's day, really, who works here. Oh my god. Um, we've even managed to get a crate stuck in the wall over here. Like, that's pretty wrecked to me. I don't think I've seen any more wrecked warehouses in my life more than this um well, that's pretty that's pretty dope it's cool but it's just like there's nothing else to do there we go we've done it we've done it we've, we've wrecked the warehouse just exactly what it says on the tin well there we go if you want to play that one i mean i'd give that three lobsters out of ten to be honest because like 
there's no substance to it really it's just a warehouse and you're wrecking it i mean it's 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 saying what it says on the tin i mean you, you get what you get it gives what you want it gets what you ask for it does what you want it to do all right i don't know how many times you want me to say it or different variations you get what you give what um i don't know three disabled cats out of ten to be honest um at least give a story bro okay well at least the next one um is a bit more of a simulation of something that we can do stuff in um that's very vague but yeah, we're going to be playing... Uh, okay, next we're going to be playing Police Station District. This seems pretty interesting. Um, it's, I think, Spanish. So you're going to have to bear with me. I don't understand what the heck is being said. I think it's the type of game where you basically... Um, uh, papers, please. Like that sort of game. But we're playing it completely in Spanish. So... Um, good luck to me. Do we, do we wait for people? Proximo. Oh, heck, okay. Okay, her name's Heather Moore. Um. Uh. Part of. Yes. Primboss. Okay, we're recording her. Okay, put her file. read the i don't know what it said i didn't what am i doing even if i knew how to okay i assume this is what she's been accused of this is her description she's resultaldo um yes i'm gonna say yes to her i think she's correct Is it? Can I go? Is there languages? What the hell is this game, man? What is going on? It broke, it crashed, and like it sent my computer into like some weird spazoid where it just black screened and my keyboard stopped working and just everything broke and I'm going to take it from one radar dish out of ten to zero. Zero mops out of ten, to be honest, because that, that just almost broke me and my computer. Okay, so the last one's called Control Room Alpha. Um, again, I have no idea how to play it, but it's all a part of the learning experience. We're trying to figure out if these games are playable straight off the bat. Okay, so E to interact or left mouse. Oh, what? That was my bad. Oh, yes, I copy. Interact. I knew we could do it. Right, it's serious. You know, everything's serious. We've got a coffee stain, uh, a tea stain on the on the work already. So things are looking good. You know, we know we know what our stuff, I think. Oh dear. I think we just made a mistake right off the bat. That was Okay, we're going in. We're doing it. We're, we're doing things. Oh my god, this is amazing. Yes. Okay, this is actually quite cool. Drop that. No, that's not right. Okay, I can... No. Okay, that's... Um, right. 
Uh, that was completely wrong, but fair enough. Now, I will remind you to be very careful with handling this vessel. Each one is worth over one million Vietnamese dollars. Right. So we're having to be careful, but we can actually no clip proof it. Oh dear. Okay, that's fair. You do you, man. Whoops. <laughs> right. Okay, okay. This is not your fault. The crane seems to be broken. I'm afraid mission control will not be happy about this. So just go down there and put the sample into the case yourself. Don't worry about the thing, comrade. Most of the creatures that came out of that nest are harmless. Go pick up the sample. Okay. If they're harmless, that, that's fine. I don't mind. Oh my giddy aunt, this is... Right, that's a lot bigger than I thought it was, but alright. I can hear them creepily crawling around. Cool. Well, he said they're harmless, so I'm taking his advice and just not worrying. What was that? Oh well, ignorance is bliss. Cool, we're good. Good job, comrade. We might not have gotten all the samples, but for the first time. What? <laughs> what is that? It looks like a football. <laughs> oh! Okay, well that so that one, that was pretty cool, it was different, um, I'll give that, I'd say 6 blueberries out of 10. Okay, so there we go, that was pretty much all the games, um, if you want to suggest more in the comments, I might make a reddit post that you can put them on there, uh, just share with me your favourite indie games and I'll give them a go and see what value they have on the out of 10 market in my mind. Um, and yeah, like even give me your your out of 10 of what you think they would be. Um, but other than that, thank you very much for watching. Peace out, homebred in a biscuit tin. Oh yeah.